Hey loves, welcome back to the channel. Thank you so much for joining me. Today I am gonna show you guys how I take down my Marley twists and then I am going to wash and condition my hair with the products from the July Curl Box, the Pure Honey line by Cream of Nature. I'm so excited to share this with you because I've been wanting to try this line for a while. And so let's jump right in. Y'all, I had so much fun with these Marley twists but I am ready to wash my hair. And so I'm just gonna untwist them and take them out very, very gently, making sure not to break any of my hair. The takedown process was actually very simple. It took me 45 minutes to take them out, five hours to put them in. I'll definitely do this protective style in the future, but now it is time to wash my hair. Oh, I'm so ready to wash my hair. <laughs> and so I am starting out with the shampoo from the Pure Honey line. I, I am gonna use some gloves, which was one of the recommendations I received at the beginning of my protective styling journey, just to keep my hands protected from not getting any other allergic reactions. And so saturating my hair with this shampoo. This is definitely one of my favorite products from this line. It felt so good on my scalp, you guys, like legit it was everything and so once i get my hair nice lathered up cleansed i'm gonna rinse that out and i gotta move over to detangling you guys know that coming off of a protective style it can sometimes be really difficult to detangle and so bringing in the not away leave in detangler i'm gonna apply it in sections just so that i can detangle thoroughly and make sure that i get my hair nice and smooth and then immediately after using the not away leave in detangler i'm gonna bring in um, the next product, which is going to be the Break Up Breakage Leave-In Conditioner. Now, you guys, I am not crazy about cream products in a spray bottle. It really just throws me off and it's a little frustrating sometimes to apply. However, with that being said, this is the best cream-based product that I've ever, ever tried that is in a spray bottle. It came out really nice and easily. I didn't have any trouble with it. And when I tell you that my brush just glided through my hair after applying this product, it did. And look how nice and moisturized my hair is. So good to have my hair back. And now to style, I am going to um, blow dry my hair on a low heat setting just so I don't have to worry about my hair drying completely overnight because it never does. And now it's time to bring in the next product, which is the Moisture Whip Twisting Cream. I am going to be setting my hair with this product using about a dime size worth of product for each section sometimes a little bit more just because I'm a little heavy-handed when it comes to products like this especially for setting my hair love the way this felt on my hair my twists are nice and hydrated another reason I decided to blow dry my hair is so I could assess these ends you guys I knew that I was going to need to trim my ends and so you can clearly see there's no denying where the hair needs to be trimmed. And so that is what I am doing at this point, just going through and clipping off those damaged or dead ends that just got to go. They got to go. There's no need or use in holding on to your ends when they are straggly like this. And so now that I've done that, I'm going to bring in the moisture infusion edge control not to lay my edges, but to actually secure the ends of my hair and add in moisture at the same time. This product worked great for this purpose. Next day, time to take down these twists. My hair feels so moisturized, you guys. It does not feel even a little bit dry. It is moisturized without leaving a lot of residue on my hands. I take the twist down, definition is on point, and now it's time to style my hair. I missed my stand-up hair, and so I decided to go ahead and create a stand-up twist out style using my pick of course because that is critical i'm going to separate the twist a little bit more just to make the hair more dense so that it stands up for me and then of course my signature look is of having that twist to come around and wrap around the side of my head y'all know i just miss this style so much like this is probably my absolute favorite style you've probably seen it a lot but not recently 
And for the last step, I'm just going to put a little bit of that edge control on my edges on the right corner. Those little baby hairs, y'all, I usually don't have baby hairs, but these little things was trying to come out. So I said, let me lay down these edges a bit. Hair is sitting up nicely, a nice creative accent with that twist. And that is it, y'all. This is the final look. Thank you guys so much for joining me for this video. Make sure that you like, comment, and subscribe. Click that bell in the top right-hand corner. And that's it, guys. Until next time, mwah.